Elex Forest. What we got in here? Any nasty surprises? I hope not. Don't want any more of those for this stream. Oh! <gasps> oh! Papa! A good papa who's here to make me feel better after losing my best ones! Here's Houndour! A grass type Houndour! She's a little paparino! <laughs> she my little paparino! I'm, I'm gonna go with paparino. There we go. Alright, earlier games had a problem where uh, to progress through the game you had to give certain members of your team HMs, hidden moves, and a lot of HMs are crap. They're just, they're just crap moves and they can't be removed from your Pokemon until you go and see a move deleter. So, oops. <laughs> You've got to permanently nerf one of your Pokemon to progress, basically. And it's going to have to be Doritos. Sorry, Doritos. I like it, I think. I don't know if I like it, actually. I'm very torn about that, Paris. Venom, you're currently my strongest Mon, so I would like for you to handle this situation. You're just spinning. I can get past you. There we are. <laughs> nice. Don't mind me, just gonna... Oh! Battle! Who's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? It's gonna be... Oh, Sentry again! Sentry... I don't want a Sentry! You're adorable! Don't get me wrong! I love you, Sentry! You're cute as heck! But you're not gonna cut it on this team! This is a very stereotypical name, but I kinda like the idea of just calling you Wings. 50 cent trip. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Greedent! Yes! <laughs> Actually, I've got to call you Greedent. <laughs> Just to annoy TP. <laughs> oh, when he checks the VOD of this, he's going to be he's gonna be so mad. I'm the daycare man. Do you know about eggs? We found an egg. Incredible. Would you like it? Fine. I didn't say yeah, but thank you for the egg. I am going through a trying time, so it works. The trainer didn't want the egg, so I just kept it. Cheers. I can leave Pokemon there to just level up passively, and I'm going to. Why am I not doing that? Your playground, Goldenrod City Game Corner. Game corners are a blessing for Nuzlocke runs, because if I'm willing to gamble enough, and I am, I will uh, be able to get multiple Pokemon from there. Without breaking the rule, gift Pokemon or Pokemon that you've paid for or bought, are not subject to the catch rule of Nuzlocke runs. Or at least, to my knowledge, they aren't. I moved here, but I can't sell my bicycles. Could you ride a bicycle and advertise? Sure. Thanks for the free bike, you fool. Gornach is pleased with the bike. I don't know what the heck I'm going to get. That said, I know what one of them is. The other is actually randomly generated. And also, this game changes all the Pokemon, so... It'll be more than randomly generated, it's going to be a whole other kettle of fish, so... Oh! Dang it, just literally just as I checked it. That was just enough steps, I just crossed the threshold. And now we have... <laughs> so it could be, you didn't make it! You didn't get out of it! It's still in the egg! Any name better than Eggsy? In fact, the name... Egg puns. To be honest, so the naming potential is limitless. Meggy! <laughs> Alright, you know what? Meggy's even cuter. I really like Meggy. Meggy the Eggy! Let's battle some of these trainers down here. Here we go. Forgot that trainer. Yep. I'm confident in my ability to raise Pokemon. Wanna see? Yeah, sure, why not? Let's see what you got. Let's see what you got, kid. Let's see what this camper do. Got one Pokemon. It's going to be about level 14, so it's going to match my team. Porygon. Oh, goodness. That's that's just a, that's a rubber duck Porygon. <laughs> that's just a little rubber ducky. <laughs> I like it. Oh, that's cute. I'm the best in my class at Pokemon. Good for you, kids. A lot of very cocky kids on this route. But then again, I guess they can justify it. they got relatively tough teams, giving me a little bit of... Little stress. That's just a fuzzball. That's a monkey without a nose. <laughs> you just took its nose away. No, no wonder it's angry. Where's your nose, monkey? Where your nose at? I'm gonna assume you're just a grass type. Oh, <laughs> that's even cuter than normal Snubble. <laughs> if Snubble looked like that, I would actually love it way more. 
And it would also be more fitting in how it evolves into Gramble. What type could you be? You just look like a normal type. Ooh, gosh, I, maybe you're a fighting type. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take it at face value that you're a fighting type. Let's go. I'm gonna go get a coin case, and the coin case could be found in this underground path, along with a bunch of other trainers. So, let's go and defeat some of these trainers. Ah, oh, Meggy, I'm gonna put you back in reserves. I'm sorry. You are costing me too much experience right now. Experience that I really need my main ones to have. My three main guys, so... I got booted out of the game corner! I was trying to cheat using my Pokémon! Now, in the original game, you had a Magnemite, i.e., you know, Magnets, and that made sense. I don't know if that's going to make sense here. Let's see. What did you try and cheat with? You tried to cheat with... Oh, okay, still a Magnemite! But... <coughs> <laughs> he's like that he's like that little blob thing from um monsters vs aliens but smaller and more adorable <laughs> i don't know what you are i don't even know what you are you're just a different colored slugma that's distressing all right you're still a fire type oh dear no you're a poison type this poison is a pile of goop poisonous goop uh, okay, that's less bad. Fury Cutter. <laughs> there we are. Oh! God! Th this Pokemon feels like a sin! This shouldn't be! Oh! <laughs> Chansey should never be evil! This is Dark type Chansey, I guess. Alright, well, uh, I'm a ghost, so no, thank you. Um, Scatamanga, would you do the honours of defeating this Dark type Chansey? Actually, you're a rocky Nidoran. Dig will still be good here. So will Absorb. Both will be great. Uh, I'm gonna Absorb ya. <laughs> it's just a little Nidoran statue. That's, that's that's really adorable. That's really cute. And Nido King probably looks super rad. Okay. What? It's not a statue. It's a little mechanical Nidoran. It's a little robot Nidoran. That means we're going to get a Cyborg Nido King, and I am all for that. Yes. Ditto is cube. <laughs> How did I forget that Ditto would be different? And in this case, Ditto is cube. How did I not take into account that Ditto would be cube? Oh, it's not even going to transform into me. It's just going to be a good, sharp cube. Do any of these guys need a haircut? Hello, dear! I sell medicines! They're good but bitter! Oh, I am gonna buy a ton of these. I am the guy, the only guy in the world who buys tons of this stuff. Revival Herb's pointless, because it's a Nuzlocke. But, big healing for cheap. Don't care if it makes my Pokemon dislike me. I don't care. If they don't evolve by happiness, they can suck it up. I could do with some evolution right about now. Oh, hello! Excuse me, kid, can you do a guy a favour? Can you take this Pokemon with mail to my friend? He's on Route 31, yep. I will definitely never ever give this Pokemon to your friend. I'm keeping it. <laughs> you fool. You fool! I received a Spearow. Dragon and flying! <laughs> we have a dragon type. We have a little dragon Spearow. I'm gonna take the mail off of you. Never giving that to your friend. Because I'd rather keep the birds. Do I want to catch a water Pokemon here or try for the grass up ahead? Uh, I'm going to try for the grass, I think. I'm going to battle all the trainers on the way, though. Hello. You going to the gym? Me too! Well, the gym's behind us. We're act I'm actually moving away from the gym. I'm actively avoiding the gym for now. You are as wrong as you could possibly be. That is one upsetting looking oddish. <laughs> What's wrong with you, Oddish? What happened to you? Pikachu, what did they do to you? <laughs> ah yes, the world's most beloved mascot right here. Spotty gerbil Pikachu. Oh, I love it. <laughs> it's great. Oh, goodness. Oh, sh- Why did you have to- oh! Alright, it's a nice type. It's an ice type! Ice types are my absolute bane. Scaramanga, I'm gonna need you to, to, to 
kill this Pikachu. Can y'all start evolving, please? I need y'all to start evolving. Behold my graceful ball dexterity. All right. Beholding. It's a meteorite, which makes more sense than an exploding ball. Hey, don't do my boy Voltorb dirty like that. I, li I like Voltorb. <laughs> it's, it's uh, from an RPG perspective, it's a mimic. Uh, that's what I like about it. It's designed to look like a Pokeball, which in the overworld is what item pickups look like, so... Oh! <laughs> I love it! It's like a little punk Growlithe! Oh, I love this punk Growlithe. He's so punk. I don't know what your typing is. I have no earthly clue what your typing is. I'm going to swap to my strongest just to be safe. Whatever you're going to come at me with. It looks like it's still part fire. But I don't know what else. But it is gorgeous. Oh, it's still part fire. It's going to throw embers at me. Ow. Don't like that. Uh, you're going to get thunderbolted for that. Is it fire and electric? No, it's... Okay. I don't know what its second typing is. I have no earthly clue. It does look a little bit like Toxtricity. Oh, God! Yeah, pursue all you want. I hate that move. That move is anathema to Nuzlocke runs. I'm going to kill you just for using that. Yeah, you should have embered me, idiot. Alright, I can take one ember and then kill you with a dig. And I'm going to. That's a grassy patch. Let's see what we find in here. Please be a robot Nidoran. Robot Nidoran. Oh, you know, you know I got her. You know I got her. You know I got her. I gotta get you back. Punch Burb. It has been too long. Dorito, oh yeah, Dorito will help for fire. Fire coverage. But Punch Burb is getting back in the team. Punch Burb returns to us. You will carry on your father's legacy. And yes, he's your father now. Fist. Burb. Enter the fist burb. Hello, hello. I'm here to sell you a Pokemon. A rare Pokemon. Would you like to buy one? Only 5,000. One rare Pokemon coming up. Oh, Lord Helix is... Uh, we have Lord Helix. <laughs> That's just a shrimp. It's just Brian the Shrimp. <laughs> it does not look like a human. He looks like a shrimp. Actual shrimp. Yeah, okay, that's Brian the Shrimp. Oh my god, Brian sounds like Brian. <laughs> He's a Brian Shrimp. National Park, give me your bounty. What do we have here? I get... Oh, a monkey. I already have Paparino. Paparino's gonna be my Grassmon, but... I am going to uh, catch the Mankey just in case. God forbid anything bad happens to Paparino and I need another grass type. Oh, what is that monkey called? That monkey from Dragon Ball. Bubbles. All right. Bubbles works for a monkey. Even if it is a like a daffodil in this case. Well, daffodil. Yeah, even if it's just like dandelion fluff. So, you know. We adore our Pokemon even if they dislike us. That's what being a fan is about. Your Pokemon shouldn't dislike you, unless you're doing something wrong. Like feeding them horrible bitter herbs like I like doing to my Pokemon. Out of unnecessary cruelness. Oh, it's Clefairy! Oh! <laughs> oh, I like this Clefairy! This Clefairy's gonna absolutely destroy Scaramanga. Um... That's a cool Clefairy! <laughs> um... What are you? You're not a cute... You're just a ghost! That's just a sad ghost! I wasn't expecting or ready for Cubone to look like that. Um, I was expecting it to have a little semblance to its actual form. That Tangler is distressing. Is that blood or on the end of it? Is that blood on the end of its tendrils or... What is that? Ugh! No! I disagree! I disagree with this. Disagree with this Tangler. I don't know what it even is or entails. But it's eyes as well. Ugh. Please be happier. Please don't be as sad. Please be slightly... Oh no, you look just as sad. <laughs> you look 
just as sad. If not a little more sad. So I evolved into Skip Bloom. Cycle around until it's done. Whatever's inside, it's probably going to have to just go in a box now anyway, or back to the daycare to just be raced by them for a little bit, so it's at least feasible for me to use it. Any baby? It's... Oh! He's good, though! Iggy Shock. I like Iggy Shock. This is a normal type gym, and that sounds garbage, but Whitney's deceptively hard in the base game. I hear she's been nerfed for this. She doesn't have a destructive godlike mill tank. But I'm still going to be careful around her. We have Bridget, three Pokemon, promising. That's a, that's a, oh, that's adorable. I like Jigglypuff in this. I know, I already know I love Jigglypuff in this. It looks like it's normal and electric. So that's an interesting combo. Oh, <laughs> coughing's, a, coughing's a balloon. Normal and flying type and it's a balloon. That is precious. That is so wholesome. Uh, Scaramanga, can you please come in and just, just absolutely destroy this coffin for me? Blow it to smithereens, please. Yes! Here it is. Are you ready to get checked? No amount of steroids are enough. Don't talk to me or my son ever again. Oh, I feel just even just hitting the A button, just kind of running a shiver down my spine. Hi, I'm Whitney! Everyone was into Pokemon, so I got into it too! Pokemon are super cute! You wanna battle? I'm warning you, I'm good! Those, that, that sentence, that whole dialogue tree, it's just ingrained into the minds of so many people through repeated, ruthless thrashings from Whitney's Mill Tank. Four Pokemon. Alright, what level are they all gonna be? Oh, okay, sign with a Porygon. Interesting start. Porygon, to my knowledge, is a part water type, so... Do I use a growth? Do I actually set up for a sweep? I'm gonna do it, because I can heal. There's a growth. Just lactates the party to death. It really does, it's a nightmare. It's an absolute living nightmare for Pokemon to deal with. Alright, water gun's not gonna do much to me. Oh, yes it is, never mind. It's actually going to do a ton of damage to me. Alright, I've got to be careful there. Thunderbolt is going to deal with Porygon though, so that is nice. Alright. Maybe I didn't need to set up. Or oh, it depends on what's next. Snubble. Alright, fighting types. Yeah, of course you're coming out with a fighting type, so I am going to have to change Scatamanga. As I swap over to Fist Burb. Here come the Fist Burb. Ready to give you a good dang punch. For your hubris. Oh yes, here we go. Here come the fist! He said before kicking with his noodly little legs. <laughs> Alright. Tail whip, wow! Okay, you're doing that thing where you just give me the win or you're just putting me into a false sense of security, one of the two. Muck punch, done. Wow, alright. Am I overthinking this Nuzlocke? Am I getting too scared? Did that rival battle just spoop me that hard that I don't trust this game to not kill me? I don't know, maybe. Uh, Scatamanga, deal with the coughing. <laughs> face! That sweet, happy little face is so wholesome. It's so precious. Um, Thunderbolt. <laughs> Get dead, coughing! Not wasting any time. Not letting you have even an inch over me. Not letting it happen. The Scaramanga's almost devolving. <laughs> Mantine! Okay, that's a change. Uh, I imagine Mantine's still gonna be flying type, though. It'd be weird if you weren't still flying type. I am gonna be relatively careful here. I'm gonna get Top to come in and set up a Leech Seed. It's a kite! It's a kite! <laughs> That's adorable. That's very cute. And also not great for my current situation. Shouldn't have switched to you. I should have switched to... Should have kept Scaramanga out. Okay. Uh, thinking, thinking, thinking. You're going to come up with a flying type attack. I know you are. Scaramanga, I would like for you to come in and tank the flying type attack, which I know you will. 
And I know you will effectively. And then I will heal you and then do a finishing blow. Do hidden power? No! Why? What is the type? I don't know, even know what that type that was. I had no way of knowing what type that was. And I still don't. I just have a mystery move that can absolutely F me. All right. Let me think about this. It, he was going to use it on top. But it was super against Scaramanga. Super against Steel. So it's either fire. It's fire. It's fire based. Came out with a fire based move. So, um. Oh, Scaramanga, you were so close. <laughs> you were so close to evolution. I was, you're going to be my crutch for the rest of this. Um. Who can deal with fire? Not Paparino. Not Venom. Kenya. Kenya, I wasn't expecting you to end up being a little. being something of a. A necessity, but maybe. Oh yeah, I'm gonna come in with a glare. I'm gonna paralyze you. I'm gonna kill you with this bird. I'm gonna peck you to death with this. I'm gonna peck all the holes in you until you're dead. Come the f on with confusion. Stop that. Even without the mill tank, it's still a Whitney battle, isn't it? A battle which is gonna end relatively pyrrhic. Oh, crit at the end. Just to really rub it in. How much did you get for that, Kenya? That's a lot. Ah, oh, but not quite enough to get the level up, thanks to Tot. <laughs> Tot took a little bit of credit there, even though Tot did nothing. Ah, ah you mean? Good. You killed my strongest Pokemon, you horrible person. <laughs> you meanie. Give me the badge, Whitney. I'm not doing this whole rigmarole with you. She always cries when she loses. Give me the badge. I have no patience for you. Your malarkey. Scaramanga. It was not meant to be. Oh, the three Pokemon I was most adamant about keeping on the squad have all left us. But we still have a fist burb. <laughs>